and it's a race full of emotions. We came all the way to France for the biggest windsurf race in the world. 1,400 windsurfers in one place. That's 24 buses loaded with people. Aren't you wondering if there's any wind left, if you're covered by all these sails? If each person brings two boards, that's 2,800 boards on the beach. Can you even imagine what that looks like? Well, you don't have to, because you see it right behind me. I'm expecting carnage, tough races, 40 kilometers per race, and of course, I want to finish in the top 20. I can't wait to get started. But let's start right from the beginning on our way down to France. Beautiful freeway food. Mm, nice veggie patty. Not sure if it's actually veggie though. Bonjour France, on our way from Italy, PWA Lake Garda, to France, the Defi wind. My French is not so good though, I don't know much. I know bonjour, ça va? Do you want a Fritz Cola? Tu veux un Fritz Cola? Tu veux un Fritz Cola? Oui, oui. days before the Defi wind, right over there you guys can see the beach already and this is where it's all gonna be happening. Well, a couple of hundred meters down there and it's freaking windy so I gotta prepare my gear a bit, set up uh, foot straps in the right way so it's comfortable for really long distances, uh, see how I compare with the foil to the fin because that's also gonna be an interesting question. I would say let's get going. 62 and a half. Looks like I'm gonna be pairing this with a 5.3 today. Never tried the sail so far, the new one, so really curious how it's gonna be. I think we're gonna have fun out there. Is known for strong wind. 
Especially in springtime, with low pressure over Italy and high pressure over the Atlantic, the wind accelerates down and past the mountains in the inland of France. It often hits the beaches in south of France with more than 30 knots of wind. Grosson is actually a perfect beach for such gigantic race, because the wind blows straight offshore over the sand. Offshore does sound dangerous, but it makes for the easiest conditions possible. You can sail super close to the shore and even in strong wind, the water is as flat as a pancake. It's on guys, we just received a one hour countdown and that means we're less than one hour away from the first race. Uh, it's super exciting, I'm gonna go grab my stuff, get ready, maybe make a few test runs, uh, get out there and well, in about 53 minutes and 35 seconds, we're off to the first race. I'm literally starting downwind of almost 1,400 sails. If the average sail size is 5 square meter, this makes for 7,000 square meters of coverage. That's a whole soccer field covered with sails, or if you put them all in a row, it would take you half an hour to walk past all of them. But somehow I managed to find some wind behind all the sails.
I had goosebumps when uh, before we started the race because there were so many wind servers out there. It was insane. Sick atmosphere. Incredible. Still so many people out there. And it's a race full of emotions because it's so long. You go through ups and downs. It's quite funny. I yeah, had a pretty bad start. It happened already two years ago. It's, it's really strange with a rabbit start. It was just a bit late and then you're in the shitty winds like from the beginning on. You go 10 kilometers in the bad winds behind everyone else. You don't have a free line and it's a bit tricky. Lots of people on the water. First ever time on the Duffy. First ever race. Great fun. <laughs> yeah. Nice racing, enjoyed racing with some friends around. It was incredible because we had amazing wing. Amazing. amazing. <laughs> full, full speed. We were like 20 knots, I think. Yeah. Really fast. My goals were get finished and without injured. And I did it, so. Yeah, all well, the race uh, went quite good. Like 70%, 80% of the time I could yeah, play in and cross the line at uh, around 720 plays. Anything you want to say? Shalom. <laughs> Oscar? Uh, yeah, over here. Uh, uh, uh. Mega, is that normal? Ja, da läuft mir die ganze Zeit hinterher. Die ganze Zeit schon. Wie war's? Wie schön? Mega, kannst du dich mal fixen können? Mach mal wieder Ausladen. <lacht> Habt ihr nicht einen eigenen Stand? understand the distance we're talking about 40 kilometers per race that means with a bicycle it would take you almost two hours to finish the race I ended up finishing the races right around 35 minutes but for some people it took several hours I'm with my fucking team, I said I'm so
Action cam. <laughs> wow, so tiring. These kind of conditions really, ex or this kind of race really exposes what's uh, not well adjusted in your equipment. A couple of times during the race, I had to readjust the harness lines because then you feel it on one side if it's slightly off. But uh, I think I did quite well, huh? You did. It looked good. I, I, yeah, I didn't count, but I came up well at the start. I think maybe I was leading the race for like five seconds. <laughs> Man, but I, I really struggled with those long distances uh, to keep my speed. I was staying close to the front pack for a little bit and then I dropped back with my speed. But uh, yeah, it was good. I'm happy. I'm happy. I, I improved and the start was decent. So yeah, but still hard out there. But I think it is for everyone. How was the dead last? Dead last. Yeah, I saw you coming back. The back. Yeah. The start and no, I, yeah, yeah. I fell on the back. Oh, See this guy falling in, but still finishing in front of me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> finished fifth, but I, I don't know how I finished fifth. Really. Yeah. All right, guys, I would say this is it for this video. I finished 22nd in the last race, and the goal is top 20. So in the next video, you will see if I will be able to make it into the top 20. Don't forget, one of the members can win one of my racing boards this season. So last month, we gave away a 100 euro Surf Center gift card to one of the subscribers on this channel. Surf Center is my windsurf shop with all the latest windsurfing toys. And this month, you'll have another chance to win a 100 euro Surf Center gift card. Be subscriber, leave a comment and enter your email address in the link below. You'll also receive new PDF guides such as the latest one about trimming your sail right. And if you do decide to become a member and support us, you have the chance to win one of my racing boards. Shout out to everyone who's a member already. The link for everything is down below. Be sure to subscribe to not miss the next races here from the Defi Wind. We're gonna have a couple of more races. The wind is on and uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to see if I can do it. Wish me luck. We're here on the second day of the Delphi Wind. <laughs> <laughs>